Hey everybody, it's Luca Vert, Galaxy Tech Review, and today I've got a product from AnyKit. This is the AnyKit USB Endoscope Inspection Camera, and this is going to be USB Type-C, but they also give you an adapter for a lightning port as well, in case you are running an older iPhone uh, or iPad where you want to use this inspection camera on. Now this is going to have an HD picture, uh, it's going to have 8 LED uh, light around it as well to illuminate whatever you're looking at and the ability to take still pictures and video as well we're gonna dig into this now and I'll be right back Okay, so this is everything that we get once we get it out of the box. You're going to get two pieces of documentation here. One is going to be some safety warnings, uh, and you can peruse through those and check it out if you uh, need to. And then, of course, we get a, a user manual for the Any Kit, and the model number on this is NTC. 30p in case you need to know the model number uh, it's written in two different languages one is uh, English the other one is German it's well laid out and easy to read uh, so you shouldn't have any problems here it's going to show you where to get the uh, UC plus app for either iOS or for Android uh, depending on what device you're using this with now it'll also go over the app button instructions and our product specifications here now the camera di diameter is 8.5 millimeters. You do have a nine foot semi-rigid cable here and I'll leave those up. If you miss anything that you need to know uh, during the review, you can go back to that point in the video. Now taking a look at the attachments that we get, we do get three different attachments uh, for this inspection camera. Uh, the first one is a magnetic attachment, so if you need to grab something like a, a bolt or a screw or something like that, maybe if you're looking in a car engine or something like that, you've got that. You also have a hook attachment so that you can go down and grab something if you need to. And then you have a right angle attachment uh, to allow you to see the sides of maybe the inside of a pipe or an area uh, that you can't quite see with that straight on view of the camera itself. So you do have those three attachments they are all very handy in their own way. Now we do have uh, a little over nine feet of semi-rigid cable here. And if we look at the plug-in end, they do give you an adapter for a lightning devices or iOS devices. Uh, so if you have anything under the new iPhone 15 uh, uh, series, uh, you're going to have to use the lightning adapter. But it's USB Type-C to lightning. Uh, and if you're going to be using, uh, you know, any Android device tablet or phone that has USB Type-C, of course you won't have to worry because it's natively a USB Type-C setup. So it'll work on the newer iPhones as well with its USB Type-C. Now again, a semi-rigid cable here, and it is a nice uh, setup. Uh, it doesn't bend on you when you don't need it to. So if you need to pose it in a certain position, you're going to be good to go. You've got your HD lens here up atop and eight LEDs. Now these LEDs uh, will always be on. Uh, so keep that in mind. Uh, you have a cap on here that you can unscrew and then you can uh, screw into those threads any of the attachments that you would like to use on this, say maybe the hook attachment. Uh, we'll screw that on and just quickly show you how easy it is just to attach these onto the ends uh, and get yourself ready to go. So super simple and super easy here from any kit. Let's get it set up with the app and show you exactly how it performs. Okay, so what you're going to want to do is get the UC Plus app. I have it for Android here, but again, it's also available for iOS devices. We're going to launch that up. It's going to say that my device is not connected because I have not plugged it in yet. And you're going to have uh, two tabs here at the bottom. One is albums for videos 
and four uh, pictures that you take and the other one is going to be camera plus you do have a settings here to change your language and see what version of the app that you have so i can't click on camera yet but it is the most simple thing uh, that i've uh, done in quite some time all you have to do is plug it into any usb type c or lightning uh, and you will be up and running here that quickly so there you go we are already up and running and ready to go here just your phone and the camera itself that's all you need to get going now again we do have eight leds here they are fixed and always on which is not a huge deal i could not figure out any way within the app to turn them off or adjust the brightness on this particular model it doesn't become a big deal uh, and you will need the light if you're going to be uh, searching in a pipe or something anyway so it's fine that they're on and it doesn't really impact uh, quality of video or uh, still shots that you do take so let's get a Doctor Strange out here as uh, my uh, model for showing you exactly what kind of image quality that we're getting from this camera. Uh, you can see uh, that we are getting a, a really sharp image here. So they've done a great with the optics. Uh, you do have at the bottom right hand corner a uh, button that will go from 1x to 1.5 to 2x for zooming in as well and then we can take a photo uh, and I will show you a, a photo that we have taken with this and put it up on the screen for you so that you can check it out so you can see once I'm in the actual uh, album I can go in and I can pinch to zoom to get even uh, more in-depth uh, picture of what I'm looking at and I can also go in and check any videos that I may have taken now the focal length on this is three centimeters to ten centimeters uh, that's the optimal focal length although you could be further out no problems whatsoever on the left hand side that button will rotate you 90 degrees the middle button will uh, either do color or black and white depending on whether you need or want to have black and white or color you can do that and the third button will take you to a preview mode uh, it's a split screen mode that on the right hand side will show us uh, the last picture that we've taken and then the left hand side you have a live view as well of what you're looking at so if I need to take a picture like I just did on the right hand side is now changed on the left hand side I have my live view and you can see that we can zoom in or get closer take another picture or we can just in real time compare the last picture I took to the uh, live view as well so this also comes in handy now this app is very lightweight uh, works very well no crashes nothing like that uh, has a lot of nice features to it so overall I'm very pleased with the app I'm also pleased with the quality of the pictures and video that you get with this camera and the simplicity that it's a single cable that you just plug into to your device you don't have to worry about anything else other than the camera and your phone or tablet and works right out of the box so there you go that's my review of the any kit uh, USB inspection camera model number NTC 30 this works out really great whether you're going to use Android or iOS uh, and of course the newer uh, iOS devices are going to have USB type C anyway so this is going to work out just fine on, across all devices I did uh, really enjoy the fact uh, that you get 10 feet of cable and it is rigid and poseable uh, so you're not going to have to worry about it flopping around on you you're going to be able to get a good picture uh, the application is plug and play about as easy easy as you can uh, to get it set up and using and it produces uh, high quality images and video when you need it this is perfect for anybody that does automotive work uh, HVAC or anything else that you're going to be uh, doing uh, very close-up work that you need to be able to get into tight spaces you're going to be able to do with this any kit inspection camera this was Luke from Galaxy Tech Review. I hope you enjoyed my review, and I'll check you guys out on the next one.